Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to change the nozzle on an Ender 3 3D printer. The first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to prepare and you're going to want to scroll down to preheat PLA or ABS depending on what you have in your printer. So the next thing you're going to do is pinch right here, push the filament in quickly and then immediately pull it out. That way you don't end up with any extra filament in your nozzle so we can remove the nozzle. The next thing that you're going to want to do is let your printer cool down. Once your printer has cooled down to about 60 degrees, you're going to want to pull this black silicone sock off of here. And then you're going to just set it down so you can get access to the nozzle. So the next thing you're going to want to do is take a 6mm wrench and use it to loosen the nozzle. But be careful because it's still hot. Okay, so you gotta let your nozzle cool down before you can move it. It should take about one minute to cool down. So the next step while you wait for your nozzle to cool down is that you can start letting your printer cool down by going to prepare, then scrolling down to cool down and selecting it. So the next thing you're going to do is take your new nozzle and put it in here once your printer is cooled down and twist it with your fingers. And then once you get it as tight as you can, use your 6mm wrench to tighten it down the rest of the way. Don't tighten it too much though, otherwise you could break your hot end. And so the final step that you're going to do is you're going to take your silicone sock, if you use a silicone sock, and you're going to push it back on while the hot end is cool. You need to make sure that you push it all the way up in between there, and it goes all the way around the hot end. That way it doesn't fall off while you're putting and cause a mess. So, so the next thing you're going to do is hit prepare and then hit preheat. That way you can load your filament. And you can reload the, your filament. The first thing you're going to want to do is cut it at a diagonal angle. That way it goes into the slot easier. And then you're going to pinch the two black guides. And you're going to push your filament all the way in. Until you start to see it come out of your new nozzle. So then the final thing that you're going to do is you're going to have to re-level your bed because the new nozzle might sit at a different height than your other one. And then you can go ahead and print. Thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.